Soon there will be $9 million of federal money flowing into small businesses. That money is coming in the form of a grant from the American Rescue Plan Act. The city of Detroit fought for money during a bid and won $9 million. So Nick Monticelli found out how it will be spent and who gets it. Many of us are still functioning month to month, week to week. Nefertiti Harris has a great salon on Woodward in the new center area, but she opened it the day COVID shut Michigan down. She's still here, but barely. Many of us don't want to talk about it, but it is the truth of the matter, where we still are not able to pay ourselves. That's why this $9 million is a very big deal for these small businesses. Something the Detroit Economic Growth Corporation understands. Small business backbone of this city, we know that. Kevin Johnson is the president of the DEGC and says they have until December to figure out exactly how the money will be dispersed, but they have a framework of categories. One is to do grants and loans to the small businesses. The other is to do debt reduction and pay down the cost of some of the debt that was incurred while they were trying to survive. And the other is more on the technical support, holding workshops, making sure that when they do uh, receive these dollars that it is used in the right and proper way. And the proper way will be different for every business. But either way, Nefertiti sees it as a tremendous opportunity. There is no Detroit without a community small business because we are the businesses or the individuals that have a direct connection with the people that come into our spaces. What's also great about this is the city has until the end of 2025 to allocate all this money to all of these businesses. So they don't have to rush into it. They can see who could really use the money and how it's going to be best spent before making a rush decision. In Detroit, Nick Monticelli, Local 4.